I'm like a big daddy's girl, so. Like literally, I love my dad. It's gonna be hard. <laughs> it's gonna make me cry thinking about it. Honestly, like my mom has helped me out like so much. <laughs> No, but my mom has like literally helped me plan so much of this wedding. Like I couldn't be more thankful. We've planned this for so long. It has been amazing. I can not, all I can say is exactly how we planned it out. Uh, her mother has been planning this and waiting for, she says 24 years, it's been 30 damn years <laughs> all right, for this. As, ever since we even talked about getting married, she's been planning this. Although this is overwhelming to give Casey away, it's also relieving and to know she is marrying a good man and in good, into a good family. All right, Casey, I've spent a, long, a lot of time together with her as she's grown up. Either running on running deer beagles, sitting in a blind or a stand together, or elk hunting out west in New Mexico. And, uh, one of my best memories was when we were, I was letting her drive when she was 15 all over New Mexico where we were hunting. We talk about it all the time, she was only 15 and we had a blast, didn't we, babe? We did. Thank you. Casey was and, a, and is a gift from God. I will always be grateful for him allowing me to be her father. All right. She now does God's work by being a nurse and bringing life into this world each and every day she's at work. We all thank you for that. Harrison, Casey has always adored you and loved you. And I was jealous. Almost from that day on, she loved and adored you. It's taken me a while. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> but seeing her so happy and being joyful in her eyes, I tell you, we welcomed you into our home and our family. All right. It helped that you had good parents, because, I mean, we would have kicked you out a long time ago. <laughs> now, to both of you, I say keep God in your life. Share your joys and your burdens. Love and laugh a lot. Be each other's best friend. And always, and I learned this from my wife, Always speak good of each other, even in private. That's important. Very important. One day, God willing, you two will bring a new life into your family and get to see exactly and how a parent can love someone 
so much. It will be the joy that's overwhelming, I promise you. To Casey, you will always, always be my little girl. And I will always be there for you. And I've always said this. You know this. I will be there until my last breath on this earth. I love you, baby. Love you. I love you, though you think you already know. I remember I thought you looked like an angel wrapped in pink, so soft and warm. You've had me wrapped around your finger since the day you were born. You beautiful baby from the outside in, chase your dreams, but always know the road that'll lead you home. But to me, you know, you'll always be my little girl. Can't touch me. That's what I'm talking about, guys.